think that's pretty close right there. May I take a peek? Yes. So this is just for roughing it in. Right. And I got the little one and then the, the crosshair right here. And see what you think. I think I'm pretty close right now. Now, I'm not... Yeah. How many yards do you think that is? I got my... Less than 200. Less than 200? Okay, yeah, we'll shoot it right there and see where it goes. about 140 yards. Okay, so we'll shoot it right there and see. Okay, I'm in no hurry. Alright, so Ron, what are you doing? I'm uh, oiling the inside of the uh, barrel. Now the rounds that they're shooting is steel. No, the ones that they originally shot. Okay. I shoot the aluminum one. That's what yeah, I, I understand shoot. that. But but the, but the the original that they're made to shoot was steel. Yeah, they were a little bigger and they were steel. Well, and they had explosive ones and then they had the solid ones. Now, how did they make the explosive ones explode? <laughs> <That's>, <laughs> we just talked he about. He was asking it. the same question. Yeah. Now they did. Now the Civil War ones with the round balls. Right. They had a deal that they cranked in the top. Uh huh. And if they wanted to blow it up over the top of the people, uh -huh. then it would be like so many seconds on the fuse. Right. So when it fired off, the flame to come out of it would ignite it. Uh huh. And then whatever charge they had, it would uh, blow up. Uh, but this top. didn't ever have a time fuse. No, I don't. Yeah. I don't think that so. That makes sense. I don't think so. I, you know, something. Impact. Yeah. Anyways. Uh, there's only six uh, six of these that people own. I bought this. Other one. And um, so I still have it. That's working. You know, is what's cool. And uh, 1898 is the cutoff for California. Anything, uh, anything um, after 1898. Yeah, unless sometimes they allow them if they have this. It's how they're up. Uh, how they fire them off. Uh huh. But you can't have like a you know, a cap on the end of it. Okay, good. so what does that run? It's a bullet with powder behind it. All right. Let me do a thing here. <laughs> you know, I'm not a very good narrator. Okay, doesn't matter. narrate now, Ron. Just talk normally. <laughs> what do you got there? Okay, you got the bullet. You yeah. got the styrofoam as a, a spacer because it's supposed to take a pound and a half uh -huh. of powder, and this is only one pound, so okay. It takes that clearance out, and then it keeps the bullet from sliding back, which you don't want it to. Right. You want it all the way up there, beaded against uh, where it's going to rifle. Does up. that ring fit tight in the bore, or does it swell up when the uh, gunpowder goes off? Well, this thing, when it goes off, the rifling will be all the way through this. I hope we find a bullet. I don't know if we will, but yeah. it, it has deep rifling in it. Cool. Yep. So. And Ron, you make these yourself? Yep. yep. For yep. fifty dollars, you said. No, uh, for him. Oh well, no, that's that's, that's powder and everything. Him. That's a shot. Oh okay. Yeah, that's powder and everything. That's one shot. So this is uh, what I do is I put this uh, for one it helps hold the bullet in place, which works good. But since I'm not using a pound and a half of powder, I gotta take that space inside and not mm -hmm. have it just floating, and then have the bullet slide out. So, anyways, bullet in. I put this in here. Okay, and then the powder goes in behind it. Okay, because that thing goes in there. We're good. Okay. Okay. This. Okay, you guys ready? Here we go. Oh, wait. Okay. What? Hey, I wanted to be dad. You got to get out from behind it. Dad. He will. He knows. Okay. Fire in the hole. Jeez. Whoa. Goodness. <laughs> Lord. Whoa. You got a slow-mo. Oh, yeah. my God. Dude, you're going to be able to see the dirt come out. I know. Like... Let me grab it again. Yes.
Did I say fire in the hole last time? Mm -hmm. That's... Oh, you guys all ready? Not yet. Okay, you just tell me when. Okay, everybody ready? Okay. Fire in the hole. Wow, we almost ricocheted to the top of the hill. You hit the inside of the circle. Did I hit the inside, the middle? Yeah. The inside or the bullseye? No, the inside of the circle. You went like six inches in. Fire in the hole. Okay. Fire in the hole. Okay, we put a hole in that hill. <laughs> Holy shit. I feel like that was more gunpowder. Yeah, was that more? That more than no. I think you're standing maybe more in front of it. Oh, dude, maybe because it, it was, I was more even with it. Okay, now that shit. thing's going to be stuck in the hill, so let's go see how deep it went. Holy shit. <laughs> That's amazing. Look at that thing. Uh-huh. I like that. That... Boy, that's perfect, man. And then you don't see any gulling in here, so yeah. you know you see a little bit of the rifling right here, but I think it's shooting pretty, yeah, pretty so good. This wasn't there before, right? That's the rifling. Yeah. And then this is from the dirt right here. Yeah. Yeah. Cool.